A segment we call On the Radar is a part of the newscast where we sit down and talk with an individual or particular group that is currently making a positive impact on our crew. During the dry dock back in May, it was announced there would be a new position opening across the fleet. That position would be for a new crew enrichment administrator. Interviews were held and the announcement came that Adrian Pantonio would be taking on the new role. I recently had a chance to sit down with Adrian and ask him some of the details of this new position and what this all means for the crew. Good day, Jewel Crew. Today we have with us a special guest on On the Radar, your crew enrichment administrator, Adrian Pantonio. Hello. How are you doing, Adrian? I'm good, Daphne. Thank you for inviting me over. Absolutely. Thank you for sitting down with us. Mm -hmm. So tell us a little bit about the position. What do you do? How do you plan to improve the life of the crew on board the ship and off? Okay. Well, um, basically the crew enrichment admin is um, put in place so that we can provide uh, some form of fun and recreation for the crew to make the crew happier. Uh, my first day was the 3rd of June and that was our crew party when you and I hosted together. Yes. <laughs> that was my very first day and it's like a, a baptism of fire for me. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So tell us about the climb up. Where did you start? What position did you start with NCL okay. and when? Right. I started um, on the 23rd of February. I signed on as a recreation staff. Mm -hmm. Three months down the road, um, a friend from the Christian Fellowship um, informed me that uh, there is a, an opening for a crew enrichment admin. <laughs> Alright, you mentioned a Christian fellowship that you have on board. Right. Uh, can you tell us a bit about that? Anchor for the Soul is fleet-wide. It exists in every NCL ship. Mm -hmm, it does. Um, mm -hmm. I was told, if I'm not mistaken, that it's existing for about five to ten years now. Mm -hmm. but, but you do lead the services, uh, yes, correct? Yes, I do lead the services about uh, from 10 to 25 Kind of varies weekly. Yes. Do you have a music worship ministry? We do, we do. Um, Tuesday nights is for the international service, English service, 11.30 mm -hmm. p.m. at the lecture room. Thursday is our Bible study prayer partners group. Mm -hmm. And then Sunday is our Sunday, 11.30 p.m. lecture room is our Filipino gathering. Okay. Is this... Um is it uh, non-denominational? Is it centered around Catholic or what? You're right. It's uh, non-denominational. Mm -hmm. We also have a suggestion box by the I-95 mm -hmm. near the Kuhn Richmond Board. If they have some suggestions, comments, and hopefully compliments as well yes. for the activities and uh, the events that we've been having so far, we would love to hear from them. Okay. And I'm also planning on putting in the July bulletin board the um, suggestions that they've uh, given so far mm -hmm. and what we've been doing or how are we going to take action on some of the, their ideas. Okay, great. Is yes. there anything else you'd like to share with our beloved crew? Well, I'd just like to invite everybody to take part and uh, be engaged with uh, the events and activities that we're having. Okay. Yes. All right, Adrian, that all sounds very positive, and we have a lot to look forward to. Thank you so much for coming to Jewel News to speak with us. Thank you so much, Daphne, and thank you, Josh.